And this is the first um, research funding specifically for childhood dementia that we know of around the world. So this is really a massive step forward. Um, it's for three million dollars, which is um, which is a drop in an ocean in the ocean, but it is um, a great start, and it is really um, shining a light on childhood dementia in the research world, and starting up some really great pro projects that are going to grow and really um, move the field forward. Uh, so we're partnering partnering with the researchers that are applying for funding. Um, out of this grant round and making sure that the families and the patient's voice is represented in those proposals and that the projects are addressing um, aspects of childhood dementia that are a priority. We are also making sure that the teams that are applying um, are as good as they can be. We've been able to um, match up researchers to collaborate and um, put together stronger proposals. And we've, we're also starting to see in these proposals that um, the researchers are keen to uh, focus on multiple disorders at once um, rather than the traditional way of just uh, studying one disorder at a time. So the situation at the moment is that researchers often only work on one type of childhood dementia in isolation and it's really difficult for them to get enough funding and resources and infra the infrastructure that they need um, to move their, their research forward. So things like um, setting up biobanks is going to be much more efficient if we do it for 70 different disorders than just for one. Um, sharing patient data requires um, a whole lot of um, infrastructure that is too difficult and too expensive to um, set up for one disease. But if you do it for all of the childhood dementia disorders, it becomes worthwhile and, um, and efficient and a good, good use of um, funding. If you're a, a researcher, uh, working in childhood dementia or any other related field or um, any, anything that um, has a connection to childhood dementia, um, please get in touch. Um, you can join our Research Alliance on our website or just get in touch for more information and we may be able to connect you up to other researchers um, and build new collaborations.